Hello everyone, hope you're all doing well. Don't forget, if you like the video, click on like and subscribe and talk about it on chat lines, wherever it is your social media activities and help us to grow and help more people. I'll talk to you soon. Relaxing White says, first let me relax a little bit with tea. Mm, very good. So, 33 Male USA says, my ex-GF is dating a new guy. All right. Uh, the guy is crazy drug dealer and is feeling is feeding her drug addiction. I'm scared she will die. Should I try to fight the guy or try to talk to her to get her back? <sighs> Look, everybody has their choices. You're not responsible for her. You want to prove that you're a better guy because you care about her. You cannot care about her more than she cares about herself. If she cannot see that, if she's uh, made the choices of the wrong choices of getting into drugs and hanging around the guy that is in the, you know, drug dealer or whatever that obviously is not doing her service, it's her decision. You can talk to her. Don't confront the guy. It's not your business. It's her decision. And she's not with you. It's X, yeah? All right. She had her chance. She had her choice. If she doesn't have the brain capacity and the wisdom to choose a man of clear life and clean life, and instead she's gone into that kind of a lifestyle, it's not your responsibility. You may try once. Talk to her on the phone without referring anything to the guy. None. Just about her and her life and give a few maybe words that you think you want to give her and help her to see the future of this kind of lifestyle once and if she is not ready for it she's not willing to accept it you have no responsibility hmm? if you know her parents you can call her parents and say well look I tried to talk to her about certain hazards. I'm not sure, but I think she's getting involved with some people who could be in such lifestyle. And I care about her enough to want to let you know if you can help her. That's it. And pull out. Go by your life. You're not responsible for her. If she cannot see it, it's her problem. And... With that kind of a stupid person who prefers that kind of a lifestyle, you don't want to have anything to do with her anyhow. I know you like her and all that, but, but, but what is it to like? This is what's going to set the tone of your relationship. If her consciousness is not working well enough to choose that kind of a behavior, that's going to be trouble for you all your life. Or you're going to deal with a girlfriend who's drug addict. It's not going to be easy life. Huh? So, maybe out of goodness of your heart, you want to. I don't think you should because she's old enough. She makes her own decisions. She had her choice to be with you and her chance. She didn't take it or somehow she went to where she went. You can help her by explaining some things and that's the end of it. And further, maybe to her parents, if you know them well, and that's the end of it. Pull out and go about your business. And Sid says, thank you, General. So awesome to get these inputs. They put me back on track. They better. Otherwise, you're going to meet my ugly stick. You know that, right? So you guys better take good care of yourself. So stop this bullshit of, you know, fearful, a future and all that shit. There is no future. There is no past. It's right now, today. Enjoy it. Do your best at this very moment. And whatever it will be, it will be. <laughs> Just make good decisions. In other words, don't do things that later on you have to sort them through. Do your best at, before you make a decision. And then make a decision that is most useful and logical. And then see the fruits that it will bear or the consequences would be at least manageable. Subscribe on my channel. Visit my channel. And go through the videos that you might be interested in. Mindthatseekstruth.com is making it one step away to talk to me one-on-one -on, -one on Skype and discuss what concerning you. 
I'll talk to you soon.